morning from beautiful, amazing Rishikesh, India. Today, I'm uh, headed off to a beautiful waterfall called the uh, Near Waterfall. It's about an hour walk to the base of the waterfall. Then you got to hike up the waterfall. And up at the top, there's a little place um, where you can get some food and uh, even stay the night. It's like a little campground. They got tents. They have a room you could stay in. Last time, somebody picked me up randomly on a scooter and I did some of the, uh, the, the trail going up to the waterfall on the scooter. That was a lot of help. I don't want to rely on somebody being nice and stopping for me or hitchhiking. So I'm thinking I might take a rickshaw to the base of the waterfall. This is where all the little rickshaws are. I need to go to a near waterfall. You know near waterfall? Near waterfall taxi. 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 Yeah, you can't take rickshaw. Okay, how do I find taxi? Is it taxi, taxi here? This side. This? Mm. Yeah. Right side. Right side. Thank you. Thank you. I really wasn't uh, trying to walk here. I really wanted to get a lift one way or another. But uh, apparently we are walking until further notice, people. You should ride this cow. You want to take me to the waterfall, buddy? I got to be honest with you guys. I really uh, wanted to catch a lift somehow. And I'm banking everything on somebody just stopping and picking me up. I really can't guarantee that's going to happen though. But it has in the past. So let's stay positive. It's already pretty steep. <laughs> I need a scooter or an open back pickup truck to pass by me real quick. Yeah? <laughs> Can I go in? But there's no seat over there. That's okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I'm good. I don't need a seat. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so there you go. That's how you do it. You just jump in the back of a truck. <laughs> bye. Okay, bye guys. Bye. <laughs> Thanks. Have a good one. See, I knew I'd get a lift somehow, but that wasn't the hard part. Right now, this road going up is a really steep road. So I'm hoping to find another uh, pickup truck with an open back to take me up that road up there. Because now I'm going way up on that hill. All right, guys. I'm sweaty. <sighs> I'm fed up. I need somebody to come get me. Somebody come get me. Somebody come get me. Hey. No. No. Oh, man. <laughs> Thank you so much, my man. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. I knew I'd catch a lift at some point. So here's the bottom of uh, near waterfall. So we're going all the way up there. beautiful out here it's in the middle of uh, this big beautiful mountain streams and waterfalls going through the whole thing right, 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 right. <laughs> 
<laughs> Thank you. Welcome to <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh man, it's amazing here. Ooh. So worth the hike. It's not even that bad when you go slow. Knowing that I'm going to swim at one point is a good feeling. Okay, this is the swim spot that I remember. <laughs> so I decided to pass on the uh, swimming experience here just because there's so many tourists and people in there. I know it won't be as chill as I want it to be. I'm going to take a swim at the uh, little camping area. There's a, a tiny, there's a stream with like a tiny miniature pool there, natural pool. Way more relaxed in this place. So that green tent right over there is my tent for the night. So let's go down and check it out. I just ordered some food. So up there was like the restaurant common area. Then down here is like the more natural common area. Some tents there that you could stay in. Hello. <laughs> Super chill little stream. You can swim here. Check it out, you can just hang out in the swings, on the waterfall. And there's really not much to do here, which is amazing. I brought a book. I brought a bathing suit, I brought some soap and a toothbrush and uh, an extra t-shirt and that's all I'll need. Oh wow, I'm so happy to be here. This is so perfect, <laughs> I love it. Stay in a tent, it's 500 rupees, which is $8 Canadian. I have absolutely no problems spending $8 Canadian to stay in such a beautiful place in the middle of nature with water and fresh air and cool breeze and uh, so far really nice people. Look at this delicious food. I got some dal, some curry, some naan, some rice. I think it was about uh, 200 rupees. Ho oh, oh, ho oh, ho, I'm ready. Food is super on point and I'm very happy to be here. I keep thinking it's going to end, but every time I hit a little peak, like right here, it just gets cooler. <laughs> it just keeps going up. There's a pipe running here. And down at the bottom, you can get water. You can fill up your water bottle with uh, out of a faucet and they say that it's spring water. So maybe this is the pipe that's coming direct from the spring 
that gives them spring water. I'm not going to go up much higher, but this looks like an easy uh, run up, so I might as well see where this leads. Wow. Oh, wow. It just keeps going. It keeps going. This place is beautiful. <laughs> It doesn't feel like India. It's like, uh, it doesn't feel like the India that I'm used to anyway. But maybe that's because I haven't explored much of India. And maybe there's tons of places like this here. It's a good feeling. It's definitely not Delhi, <laughs> that's for sure. Okay, I'm gonna head back down. was fun. And now I feel like a chocolate banana pancake. Mm, super good. I never want to leave this place. I'm going to read a book chill out here i brought my pillow out here look at this amazing view the sun setting on that mountain right now life is good life is good oh and check out this book i got i was at the dentist uh in rishikesh a cleaning and uh checkup was like 30 bucks canadian amazing so i saw i started reading this while i was in the waiting room beyond birth and death and uh, I asked the dentist if I could have it and she gave it to me only in India will you see books like this in the waiting room of the dentist <laughs> starting to get a little dark moon's out just ordered a aloo paratha Come enjoy. Oh, I've been up early. I'm gonna go to bed early. Oh, <laughs> gonna read a bit and go to bed, but enjoy the fire. Yeah, nice night. It's only about eight o'clock right now, but I've been up since six in the morning. It's almost my bedtime. All right, you beautiful place. Good night.